dread partner. I was my dread partner in theater weeks. Like, y'all know. Y'all know. Oh my. <laughs> y'all already know, man. Did you watch my new performance? You know, it's all I was trying. My people, what do we call this sheep? Joto? Nah. Does not sound nice. What about mm, Johan? Sounds like a female name. Hmm. Okay. What of To or Be To? That sounds like one superhero name like that. <laughs> Please, my people. What do we call this sheep? My ninja people, I hail you guys. Uh uh. Show is just starting and you guys are already shipping. In the band's voice, I must greet you guys specially. Specially. Hello everyone, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening from wherever you're watching. My name is Oluchi and I do reviews on TV shows I enjoy watching. So if you're new here and you saw this video and you decided to stop by, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Um, please do consider subscribing. It's, it encourages me. And to my returning subscribers, you guys are the real deal. Thank you so much for your support. So on today's video, I'm going to be gisting you guys on how Nigerians are already chipping Itoha and Jordan, who are both contestants on the Nigerian Idol show season 7. Um, during the theatre week, Itoha and Jordan were paired, you know, they were paired to perform a duet. They sang You Are The Reason. Let me insert a clip of their performance so you can see how beautifully they delivered on that duet. Oh my god, guys, did you hear that? See, every time I watch that clip, I catch myself smiling so hard that my cheek hurts from smiling. It was perfect. It was smooth. It was clinical. It was profe professional. See, eh, I lack the adjectives to use in qualifying that performance. You could see the chemistry that, um, you could see the chemistry between two of them, and you can see that they connected beautifully. And that is why they were able to deliver on that duet. Guys, if you had watched it when it was aired on TV, you see that Jordan was being the example of a perfect gentleman. He was holding her hands, you know, opening the door for her, letting her go first. It was beautiful to see, you know, how he was treating her and pampering her. And trust Nigerians that can ship anything shippable. They're already shipping them, even though they know that Itoha is still 17. It's not that one cannot find the love of his or her life at that age. Um, so strolling the streets of Twitter a few weeks back, I saw a tweet where um, the person was low-key wishing Itoha and Jordan would date. And the comments under the tweet were all, you know, very supportive of them dating. I wish I had taken a screenshot of that tweet, but here is a screenshot of a comment under Jordan's tweet when he posted their duet performance. Nigerians really love Lovu. I wonder what will now happen if the Bachelor or the Bachelorette is brought to Ninja. <laughs> okay guys so um for me i think itoha and jordan have gone on to build a very wonderful and beautiful um friendship it is obvious that they have something special and they understand and they understand themselves please guys i am not saying that they are dating uh, it's just people who love them um are wishing that they would date you know probably because they love the idea of them being together or because they see some kind of chemistry between them I love Itoha. I love Jordan. I wish them well. Love is a very beautiful thing. So if in the future um, it happens for them, good and fine. And if it doesn't, good and fine as well. But the most important thing is that they are both talented and they are superstars. And I wish them all the best. So guys, thank you so much for watching to the end. I'll be dropping a video on who we get to the top five. So look out for that video. Peace out.